Wayne Richard Embry was a true pioneer, making a lasting and historic impact on the game of basketball. Drafted in 1958, Embry's NBA playing career spanned 11 seasons. He was a five-time All-Star as a member of the Cincinnati Royals, a part of the 1968 Celtics championship team. And the following season, which would be his last, he was named the first ever Milwaukee Bucks captain. But his most notable accomplishments would come after his playing days were over. In 1971, Embry was hired by the Milwaukee Bucks to serve as their general manager, becoming the first African-American GM in the NBA and in any other major U.S. team sport. After leaving the Bucks, he accepted a similar role with the Cleveland Cavaliers. Then in 1994, Embry made history again when he became president and COO of the Cavs, the first African-American to be named NBA team president. He won two NBA Executive of the Year awards during his time with the Cavaliers. He helped pave the way for some notable GMs, such as Brooklyn's Billy King, Orlando's Otis Smith, and Detroit's Joe Dumars. In 1999, Embry's contributions to the game were recognized as he was inducted into the Naismith Memorial Basketball Hall of Fame. Wayne Embry is one of the most influential executives in NBA history and will forever be remembered as a true barrier breaker.